Hi kiddos, welcome back for our nature studies lesson for today. We've been talking about vertebrates, the animals that have spines that we can put into different groups based on certain things about them. So if you remember, our first group has warm blood and lays eggs, and that is birds. Our second group also has warm blood, but they have live babies, and these are mammals, okay? Then we learned about our third group, who are cold-blooded and are born on land. And these are called reptiles, okay? So today we are going to look at our fourth group. This group is also cold-blooded, okay? So we have another cold-blooded group. And this group does not have their babies born on land. This group has their babies born in water, okay? And then we have to do one more thing about them. They also have scales, okay? So they're cold-blooded, their babies are born in water, and they have scales. What would this be? Fish, okay? So easy word today, fish. Okay, we're gonna get to draw all of this in the water today. Fish, so they are cold-blooded, born in water and scales, okay? Now you can think of all the different kinds of fish that live in our different biomes. You can think of the ocean or fresh water, okay? And what would these be? You can have a shark in here. Do -do 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 -do. Okay, this is not my scariest shark. I gotta give him some teeth. Okay, here's my shark. So shark counts in the fish family. Their babies are born in water. They're cold-blooded. They have scales. Okay, here's, a, here's my shark. He looks more happy than scary. Sorry about that. Okay, you can have trout, like in a river. All kinds of fish swimming around. Whatever kinds you want, okay? Fill this page up with fish, so this can be kind of like doing your ocean picture all over again, again but you want to make sure you don't have any octopuses in there, okay? No turtles. We only want to have fish in our picture, okay? Cold-blooded, born in water, have scales. That makes you a fish. And this is your fourth class or group of animals, so we would come back here to our cover and find the number four and draw a fish of some kind because group four is fish. And then I'd go ahead and color that in, okay? So there is your fourth group. Remember that slides in the back of your biome book in the vertebrate section. And that's it for nature studies today. I'll see you tomorrow.